Hey guys. Okay, I liked the position of my last mukbang, but I feel like I could do better. And I think that this makes it even closer. Let me focus this. All right. Hey. Yes, I am kneeling on my floor. I just, I like when you guys can see the food, but I like when you also can um, be close up because the last one was a little too far away. Um, my back kind of hurts though. But anyway. <laughs> I made goat cheese pasta last night. And I have so many leftovers, so I was like, oh, why don't I just do a YouTube mukbang for you guys? It's so good. I'm probably gonna go back for seconds. I was stressing out because I made egg salad yesterday and this, and we're going away for New Year's Eve. And I'm like, I need to eat everything. It's so funny. We decided last minute to go to New York. <laughs> and I was just there. <laughs> One of our friends is having a party, so. We going. And Will's boyfriend, Kevin, is renting a car. So that'll be better than the bus. Honestly, I feel like this would be such a good position if I put the camera here. It could be really good ASMR. Like, how much do you guys want to see my face, you know? Probably, you probably don't care to see my face. <laughs> but at least you can see, like, inside of the bowl, unlike last time, right? I don't know, y'all. Do you have any advice? Maybe I'll, I, this is what I was thinking. I was thinking. <laughs> hey of getting a tray like that will go over my legs <laughs> and then like on my desk I can put it so then I can be like I don't know if I like that idea um kneeling's not that bad it's kind of fun so yeah we got a rental car I feel kind of bad because Neither Will or I have licenses. So we can't drive. But thank goodness Kevin is driving. But I feel bad because whenever we go on like road trips with like my friends, I always feel so bad because like we can never help out with the driving. I don't think my friends would want me to drive anyway. I'm, from what I remember, I'm not a good driver. But I I have probably said this a million times, but I haven't driven since 2018. Because I left my license in a McDonald's. <laughs> I have a DC identification card. And I have a passport with a really scary photo. It's like terrifying. Maybe I'll put it on the screen. <laughs> oh my God, what hideous is it? <laughs> my friend's like, you look like Ghislaine Maxwell. And she's not wrong. Oh my God. It's hot in my room. I posted this on my TikTok last night and when it's just made, like the last time I made this on YouTube, you saw it when it was just made because I showed you how to make it. Um, but it's a lot creamier. Leftovers, the leftovers aren't like dry per se, but it's not as exciting as when it's just made. But it's still delicious. Sometimes I'll add like olive oil or something. 
It's because goat cheese, I feel like it clumps up, you know? So I think that I am addicted to shopping. So for New Year's Eve, I wanted to get like a little like two outfit. So I just came back from Zara and they had absolutely nothing there. It was crazy. So I went into Nordstrom Rack. I didn't see any New Year's Eve outfits, but I found these cute sweaters and I was like, I'll just get these sweaters because they're kind of cute. And I was waiting this long line and I was just like, you know what? I don't need, <laughs> I don't need these sweaters. So I put them away and left, which is a big step for me. Normally, whenever I go into store, I'll always find something that I want to get. Even if it's unrelated to why I go into the store in the first place. <laughs> My new thing is I really want to find more parachute pants. So let me know your favorite like parachute pants brand. There were some people saying that I keep seeing like Amazon hauls and people get like parachute pants from Amazon, but I feel like Amazon is such like a hit or miss kind of site when it comes to clothes, you know? And I do have a pair of parachute pants, but there's a hole like in the crotch area. <laughs> I got them from Italy. Alex was like, Gabby, you spend way too much money on clothes. We were in Bari and every store we walked past, I was like, oh, look at that, look at that. So we walked into this one clothing store cause I was like, whoa, like look at this little like clothing boutique. I got all this stuff from there. And then we met somebody in a hostel that lives in Italy. And he's like, that's like the biggest clothing chain in Italy. <laughs> Stradivarius. Fast fashion. That's probably why there's a hole in the crotch. I don't even know how that happened. I never, d like, you'd think I was doing like squats or something in those pants and that never happened. I don't know. Should I go back for seconds? I'm kind of still hungry. <laughs> That's right, I got more. <laughs> I People are always like, how, like these bowls are so big. Babe, they're not that big. Like this isn't that big of a bowl. Like when I fill it to the top, it's not that much. I could eat a lot bigger than this. Ah. Also, I read something that carbs make you happy. So, how do you like them apples? I also got more because I'm like, must finish this pasta before we leave tomorrow. We come back on Monday, but I don't know how good this stays in the fridge for. The egg salad definitely won't be good, so that'll be... I'll be eating that after this. It's like that scene in Friends where Joey's like, the fridge broke, so I had to eat everything. That's me. They're coming for someone. I mean, welcome to DC. Like, when I was, oh, I hope everybody had a good holiday. Oh, I'm so rude, I didn't even ask. When I was at my sister's in Westchester, it was so like quiet because she lives in like a residential area. I love living in a city. I love the sirens, I love the noises. Well, I don't love the sirens. I mean, like if there's a fire truck, we don't love the fact that there's a fire, right? But, <laughs> I like all the noise. Like if I were to open my window right now, you'd probably hear two people arguing in the alleyway. 
they were arguing earlier today. Just look how beautiful that looks. I love putting spinach in it. Also, the fact that I don't think I've actually ever made this with feta. Which is what the original dish was. Oh well. Oh wait, I was gonna ask you guys something. I forgot. Okay, see, now I'm starting to get full. Oh, I remember what I was gonna ask you guys. Okay, after this, I'm going to get my nails done. Uh, what color should I get? I think my New Year's Eve outfit is just gonna be like black. So, whatever goes with a black outfit that isn't black nails. I don't mind black nails. Maybe I should get, no, that's so, that's maybe like a dark, dark purple. Oodly -oo. I'm always bad at picking colors. Like I always just get, I feel like I'm still like a five-year-old when I pick colors. I'm like light blue, turquoise, purple. Will's always like, what? <laughs> what were you thinking? <laughs> but do what you like. It doesn't matter. That's what I do and I always end up liking my nails. Also, why am I asking you guys? I'm already gonna have them done by the time this is posted. Okay, now I am full. I hope you guys have a happy new year and I'll see you in 2023. Oodly woodly woo. Oodly doodly doo. Love you guys, bye.